Okay, so you guys, this is about Mika the talking husky. So let me show you the photos really fast. So I tried educating her, obviously that didn't work. But here's her argument. Her vest says ESA. It also says NSAR, service animal certified. ESA. Okay, so obviously she has went through and paid for one of the fake registration websites that are scams that hold no legal um, value and she's breaking the law and she doesn't care. And they did this to get their dog on an airplane. Has no care the fact that it's, you know, illegal. And here also in her video, service animal relief area. Mika goes potty now. So I commented, and I'm going to show you guys the comments. I have screenshots of all of it because of the fact that, um, there it is again, NSAR Service Animal. That's one of those websites. You can actually look it up, NSA Service Animal. It'll pull it up. Um, so, yeah, it's fake. It's false. So the issue is that she has hidden my comments from her channel so nobody else can see them. She didn't delete them, but she hid them. And so since she hid the comments nobody else can see it i guess it's her way of thinking that oh well you know if i hide them i don't delete them yada yada i'm not stupid i'm a youtuber yo so i said i almost thought y'all were harmless and law abiding maybe you are and just had no idea i had subscribers tell me to watch your video did you know it is against federal law to portray any animal as a service animal that is not I do see where the vest says something service animal, and that's where it said NSAR service animal on it, which is illegal. The next issue is the vest says certified, which there are no certifications for ESA or service animals. The law is very clear on the only way to legally have an ESA. Same goes for service animals. You are publicly posting things on a platform available to everyone. I'd be mindful. Sorry, guys, I'm still dealing with the baby here. I'd be mindful before doing things that break state and federal laws just to bypass a pet fee on a plane. You're making more than enough money off of your YouTube to cover the fee, but you're also spreading bad information and making other people think it's okay to do this when it's not. Really hope y'all just didn't know because it's a daily struggle for us when service anim with service animals because people take advantage of the laws. Oh, and then you bring it to the service animal relief area, proving my point furthermore. Oh. Wow, NSAR, Service Animal Certified ESA. You really had to go online and pay for a fake scam registry that does not comply with federal or state law to bypass being able to have your untrained dog on the plane? Please tell me you didn't know this was also very legal and immoral. I really hope not, and I hope that this can educate you. To sum it up, very illegal. If you have any questions, message me on Instagram and I'll help any way I can. So somebody else said, Clear the dog is not a service animal. Lack of training is evident. Um, I say the fact that the vest says service animal and ESA prove it as well as an ESA and service animal are two very different things. Um, ruining it for people who actually need service animals with them. Uh, thank you so much, service dog. Pause. I was one of the people who told you to watch this. Um, and then people were asking me about my disabilities, yada, yada, yada. So here, Mika, the husky replies and they reply her vest clearly says esa what is your problem she is a queen and deserves a vacation she's a dog sorry she's a dog she's not a queen i don't see a crown and i don't see her um empire that she's ruling the airlines allowed it and we filled out all required paperwork if you have a problem protest to the airlines that allow animals to fly not to us if you don't like our content don't watch. Simple. The vest clearly states ESA. You didn't even watch the video. You came here with judgment and negativity. I didn't come here with judgment and negativity. I came here because my people told me to. And I had no judgment and negativity. I was trying to help educate. So she proceeds to say, we're just trying to give our dog the best life she can have. Seriously, stop harassing us and focus on your own content. So here's the issue. Giving your dog the best life? Cool. But you don't have to break federal law to do so you don't have to put out the things that are illegal and make other people think it's okay 
It says ESA, yada, yada, yada. It says ESA. It also says certified. It also says service animal. Falsifying a service animal will get you jail time. It's illegal. It is federally law illegal. Um, so somebody else says, I love your channel, but it's illegal to fake an ESA dog too. Let's see. So I say, and she never responds after this. After all of everything I say, she actually just hides my comment on the channel. We can't find it. Austin's been trying to find it on him, uh, his uh, YouTube, and the comments are hidden. So nobody else can see them. I can still see my comment, but it's hidden from everyone else. I say, it actually does say certified and service animal on it. The round badge. I'm not harassing you. I was letting you know the laws. I can make you my content. If you like, you wouldn't be the first I've done it to. Go look at the vest. You'll see I'm not wrong. Regardless, those registration websites do not legally give you an ESA. You are still in violation of the law. But if you want to break the law, by all means. Not like I don't have enough to show that you don't care. I wasn't hostile to you. I was trying to educate. Don't be pissy when you were the only one in the wrong. Airlines are easy to scam, but the law is still the same regardless. I was trying to make you aware of the laws in case you weren't aware falsifying service animals can result in jail time the fact that the badge says service animal is enough just trying to help someone out who may not know but you, you do you again if you care and want to learn more the legal way to have an esa not break the laws risk jail time etc feel free to message me she never did reach out to me so her video Hey, hey Gotias family. family! So today is a super special day. We're taking Mika. Hello. Yeah, in the plane. <laughs> we're taking her on our airplane for the first time ever and we're super yeah. excited. <laughs> you know I see they have um, the vest on. So yeah, they're taking her on an airplane for the first time ever. They think it's cute. They're going through six, oh, ads. Sure. We love ads, guys. That's Remember fine. you tell us to check out the general for car sh <laughs> <laughs> All right, Mika, let's go. So we got our boarding passes, and now we're gonna go walk to the gate. Mika, you have to be good, baby. This is a They're fake you service up. animal, you guys. You're I don't so care excited, if it says Mika. ESA. Oh my god! <laughs> Look at the pooling. And, and okay, baby. That's actually not safe to do without hey, boots on your dog. By the way, you can get their toenails ripped out. <laughs> She's a pro at these now. So if we so can, we're about to go through security. Closer. She was such a good girl. Let's go. All right, let's go. Mika, go to daddy. Come on. Take her leash. Oh, sorry. Oops, sorry. My dog All ran. Right, into Mika, me. let's go. We're done with security. Now we're gonna walk to the gate, the flight gate. Seriously, seriously. As the literally tens of thousands of dollars that you are making on your YouTube channel right now, you can't even get your dog trained to heal properly. But you want to. Fake it being an ESA, fake it being a service animal, because regardless of whether it says ESA, it also says service animal. So you're faking a service animal, period. I don't care what paperwork you filled out at the airlines. They're stupid. They don't know the laws. Just because you scammed them fraudulently does not make it okay. Yeah. yeah. You should have boots on your dog, seriously. Have boots on your dog so their nails don't get ripped out. Um, let's see. This one. This one. She doesn't want that one. This one. And then we'll go a little farther. Let's see. Oh, best part. Yes! Come on! Oh, okay. <laughs> she's scared. Yeah, You'll on. be okay. Wow. Your annoying dog whining and howling on a plane that you're trying to say is a certified ESA service animal through a fake registry website that you paid for. Wow. You, you know, I really hate the people that make it harder for those of us who actually have conditions because people like you make it harder on us and give us public access issues. Baby? Oh, oh, oh. Look, oh, ESA. Oh. <laughs> and then I showed you guys the photo where it yeah, says service good, animal. Good. good girl, Mika. So you have to ride down there, baby, okay? Yeah. Service animal right there. You can see it. And it says certified. Nope, you have to stay down here. Yeah, yeah good, good girl. Good. 
She was jumping all in the seats. That is not their protocol. Airlines specifically say that your dog has to stay on the floor out of the way and your dog was up on the seat. Wow. Um, let's see. The whole time the dog is severely stressed out too. Three hours later. My name is Anne Marie. Oh, we got another ad. Morgan. Hang on. She is going to be a senior. The first thing that comes to my mind. What are you doing? Oh, that's not. She's not tired. When dogs, dog John like that over stress. Your dog is stressed out, you guys. You like, you don't even know your dog's, dog's body language. That is a stress yawn. That is a, I'm uncomfortable. But you're giving your queen the best life ever. No, you're stressing your dog out. Your dog has no training. You didn't even train, do any training beforehand, I'm assuming, before going to the airport so your dog could get used to it. Good on you. The dog keeps getting up and getting in the way. We're almost, we're almost there, baby. They did seem to keep the dog in the floor for the most part. Like tw 20 more minutes, baby. Yeah, like 20. She's not whining and talking, as they say, because she's bored. She's whining and talking in this instant because she's stressed out. But y'all are going to try to make it cute and everything else to get your views and continue to get your money. But, you know, fraud is fraud. Scams are scams. And, you know, everybody's out for themselves, right? Selfish. Four minutes, okay? <laughs> no, baby, get down. Get down. Get down. You have to go down, baby. You can't sit up here. Go on. Sit down. Good. When you have to tell your dog over and over, you have to go down. You have to go down. You have to go down. You can't be up here. Um, your dog isn't listening to you. Your, your man just had to pull your dog back down. Such a service animal. Such a service animal. ESAs don't need training. But here's the catch. To legally have an ESA, you have to have a doctor's note from a psychiatrist. That is the only way you can legally have an ESA. So right now, I'm sorry, but you're breaking the law. You don't get to go and register your animal online. If you go to court, the judge is going to laugh at you. You'll be fined, possibly face jail time because it also says service on animal on there. So you are breaking so many laws and you didn't care as the comments that you responded showed. And I offered to give you help. I offered to help explain the laws, but you didn't care, right? Because you're just making a bunch of money off of, off of your talking dog and everything else, right? Wow, it's a husky. Huskies talk. Girl. Impersonating a service animal, not legally an ESA. Whether the vest says ESA or not, it is not legally an ESA. Several moments later. Oh, here we go. My favorite part. Well, mm -hmm. after that. Let me back up just a little. Oh, there we go. Service animal relief area. I did so You're good on her first flight. Oh my goodness. Thank you guys so much. Look at that, NSAR Service Animal Certified, ESA. So service animals and ESAs, guess what, are two completely different things. You have broke federal law. You have broke state laws and you scammed and conned the hell out of the airplanes, out of the getting on there, that you scammed and conned them. But you're okay with it because you bypassed the fet pet fee. And I bet you think if you can keep the vest on her, you can bypass like hotels and everything else. Maybe bring her out in public. All of which are illegal. You, it, it's, it's so wrong. It's very immoral. But I guess now we know where your morals are and that you don't have any. Coming along with us. We're out with Mika now. Going to let her go to the bathroom before we get our lift. And then we can go see some snow. Mika is so excited. All to bring her to see snow. Cool. Bring your dog to see snow. Cool. That's fine. But don't falsify, impersonate, don't scam and con your way through it. It's illegal. You can face jail time. You can face fines. And you've put it all out there publicly. Hmm. Should I call somebody? Should I call the Department of Justice? Should I make reports that somebody's falsifying? They're animals. I mean, you've got the evidence out there for everybody. Excited. Mika's waiting for her ride, right, Mika? 
Did I see snow? Yes! Maybe she'll talk. Right there, you can see it. NSAR, Service Animal Certified ESA. It says NSAR right there. That is a fake registration website where you pay a little bit of money and guess what? Your dog's certified, but actually that's not how the law works. Those websites are there just to make money, but if you ever end up in court, you're screwed because it holds nothing in the law. So that's all I'm gonna say about this. And I'm just, Mika the Husky, your videos are cute. They're funny. But guess what? You're breaking the law. You are making it harder for those who have legitimate service animals. You are, you should be fined. Maybe you should go to jail. You know, it's, that's the law though. But you don't care. You don't care. You're either pretending to be disabled or whatever just to be able to get around things with your dog and that's not okay so since you didn't want to listen like i said i'm just gonna make you my content so i hope everybody enjoyed this video and thank you for hiding the comments and yes thank you for hiding the comments First and place. and um you know i uh, hope you enjoy my content have a great day you guys